Morning everybody, Gary Porter again. Uh, I've got the brand new board done and I'll take you through it here. And I've still got problems on this damn board. I've, I screwed up the schematic so I've got to get some new boards and that'll be the final version. But anyway, we got the uh, same connections over here, A, B, and C phases. Uh, the fan, I had to add a couple extra wires because I screwed up that part of the schematic. Uh, I had put uh, 30 volts on all three of the power chips and it should have been 15 to the 5 and 12 with the 30 going to the 15. Uh, right now we're plugged in. I've got, uh, let me turn on, the, i got the fan is spinning and uh, these are the hall. Uh, power and ground, and then the three halls. I got 120 jumpered between the. Uh, I got it simply jumpered over to the to the high voltage power supply. And uh, now, before I turn it on, I want to just show you what we've got up here. Uh, this is the common point for the three phases. Is right here. Let me just pop this off of here for a second. Now, uh, that's the common point that points to, okay, so the edge of the common points up to this coil. So that's one, two, three, four, five, uh, between the sixth and seventh over here, got my hall sensors. And uh, what I found out was the hall sensor, if it's really close to the coil right here, not in the center, gives me my more speed. So it, it may be that the way the Mega 48 is running the IRAMs that uh, anyway. So I've got I've got A, B, and C here, and then uh, the three phases plugged back in. Let me get that squared away here. Okay, I've got A, B, and C here on those on those, and uh, so A, B, and C. And uh, let's crank it up here and give it a little partial turn. And uh, we're running. We're running slow because I haven't. I've adjusted the paw a little bit. But I just want to prove that the board works. And uh, so this new board is now functioning with all the changes in it, and uh, we're good to go. So have a great day.